Officers were initially called to check on some horses living on the property, but when they got there, they discovered something much worse. The boy had been tied up, unable to move and crying. Meantime, his family was just a few feet away, watching everything from inside of their home. A quiet home in the heart of Pahrump, now at the center of a child abuse investigation. A welfare check on these horses led deputies to a disturbing discovery. A young boy was found restrained on the front porch with his hands bound behind his back and legs tied together. He was also wearing multiple masks covering his face and exposed to blistering temperatures. Deputies say the child was crying and in distress. He was sent to the hospital for evaluations. The arrest followed when officers made contact with Jody Tracy, the woman responsible for the child's care at the home. Tracy admitted to tying up the young boy as a form of punishment after he allegedly peed in his bed. Even more details emerged during the investigation revealing a pattern of abuse that had allegedly been happening for over a year. A person living at the home told deputies that the child had been routinely restrained and confined, sometimes even placed in a dog crate overnight. Melissa Byington and Courtney Tracy, daughters of Jody Tracy, were also present during the arrest and expressed disbelief at the charges, stating they did not consider the treatment of the child to be abusive. Jody's husband, who was later identified as Michael Tracy, admitted he too knew of the abuse and at times even participated in harming the boy. And all four of the adults involved are facing child abuse charges. The Nye County Sheriff's Office says their investigation is ongoing. Reporting in Pahrump, I'm Melissa Bethancourt.